Greetings and welcome to this brand new video. As you can see, we are at the official GitHub page for Nugget. Nugget is completely free and the latest version, version 5, allows us to add dynamic animated live wallpapers to our devices without a jailbreak and the good thing is it works on any iOS version. The minimum version required is iOS 17 and in this video we will cover the same. Before you use it, it is always a good idea to back up your device. Also before you use it, please turn off Find My iPhone. Once the process is complete, you can turn it on again. This guide is for educational purposes and the only purpose is to demonstrate how we can add new live wallpapers to our devices. Now since we are on Windows, you will simply scroll down and you can see the requirements. So first of all, you will have to install iTunes either from the official Apple's website or from the Microsoft Store. You can simply hit these official links and then get iTunes installed first. Once iTunes is installed, you are good to go. You can simply scroll up. You will see the latest release right here. Scroll down and then get the appropriate file. So for me, I will use the Nugget Windows zip file and get it to the computer first. As you can see, I got it. Now you will simply right click and then extract all and then hit extract and you will see this folder right here. Now, before you open it, please connect your device via USB. As you can see, I have connected my iPad. Simply open this folder and then simply right click Nugget and then run it as administrator. Nugget should now load and it will detect your device. You can see my device's version. Rest assured, it is not jailbroken. You can see the same version on my device also. Getting the live wallpapers or the animated wallpapers is easy. You will simply head to releases and under the latest release, you will find the wallpapers which are publicly available. You can simply hit here. It will take you to the official Kaubanga website. You can simply scroll down and choose from the live wallpapers from here. Before you get these live wallpapers, just check out under them if they are compatible with either iPhone or iPad or both. You can see I already got the file. Now simply return back to Nugget, then hit Posted Board, then hit Modify, then hit Import Files. Simply point it towards the .attendees file you just got. Open. All right, you can see it is now added here. Now hit apply and then hit apply changes. Once complete, the device will now reboot. All right, as you can see, after the restart, I'm back at my device. Now to apply it, simply lock it. Press and hold the lock screen, then hit this plus button. Then scroll down under collection. I will see the wallpaper we just added. Simply select it, add, then hit set as wallpaper pair. And you can see it works without any problem. It is smooth. Now, just in case you want to remove these live wallpapers and return your device back to stock, it is easy. Open Nugget, then go to poster board, then hit this button, clear collections wallpapers. And you will see this message right here. Then hit apply, then apply changes. Once the device is back after the restart, you can see under collections, the wallpapers we just added are now removed. That's all for this video guys. If you still have questions, please ask in the comment section and I will reply you as soon as possible. I will see you in a new video. Goodbye and take care of yourself.